My name is Kelsey, and I'm not a statistic. I went into foster care when I was 16. I always told myself that no one can take your education away, so <laughs> as long as I do well in school, I can have a future. I went into foster care with my backpack from school, so no clothes, shoes, pictures, anything. It's just hard because you don't really have any materials that could have sentimental value or physical value, and you become totally reliant on someone else. And in my case, I had become reliant on myself because my parents didn't take care of me, which is obviously why I went to foster care. Focus on school, so that was my one focus. So that if I do well, I can succeed and go further and be whatever I want to be. And no one can take that away because knowledge is power and it can't be taken away from you. Once you know something, you know it. Because of what I'd went through, I was more mature than almost all the people my age and anyone who would be my friend and and so it's hard to have a connection with anybody who feels like they can't connect to you and so it increases your thoughts of being alone and that no one can understand. My first year of college I went to ECU and I did exceptionally well in academics. Um, I was in the top two percentile for pre-nursing students and I was automatically accepted into the nursing school. I was really proud of myself for that, but I also had another trauma during that time and was in a bad mental state. <laughs> and I told myself either you leave or you're gonna die. But I wanted to continue nursing. Then when I got here, I found out that Wake Tech has their own nursing program and I was doing a lot better with my mental health and I was in a stable place. I had my own apartment by myself, I was working three jobs and still going through 18 hours credits and I was happy and fine with it. And it wasn't so much of survival, but learning to live life. I didn't realize what Fashion Bright Futures could offer me and coming from a background where we're not allowed to ask for help or we're trained to not ask for help. It's hard to ask for help and to know what parameters you can ask for help. If you don't have the basic necessities, you can't succeed in school. So Fostering Bright Futures wants to help us in any way we can so that our main focus can be school. Fostering Bright Futures helps you get your basics down and worry less about surviving and worry more about thriving in school and having your future and knowing that it can be bright and that you can do it. I was in foster care and I was a foster kid. That That's pushed me more to not want to be a statistic and to be successful, to prove that you can do better and to be the best that you can be and them see you shine is the best way to prove to them that you can be anything you want to be and do anything you want to do. You know you. You know your backstory and you know what you're capable of, which is anything. My name is Kelsey and the future is bright for me.